Alrighty guys, what is going on? Titanium Biscuits here, and today I'm going to be going over the best PP19 Bison class in Modern Warfare. So as you can see, I got my Bison Gold, and as I was getting it gold, I learned a lot about this gun, and I used each attachment one by one, and I think I figured out what the best class setup for it is. Now the Bison, it's a, it's a, it's not a bad SMG, it's probably just a mid-tier, because I mean at close range, it does work. It can kill you pretty quickly. It has a large ammo capacity, so you can just spray and spray and spray, never have to reload. The only thing that it struggles at is long range engagements. There's many times I've been shooting at a guy and he's just kind of far away and it just takes, you know, five, six, seven bullets to kill him. You know, he's using an M4, obviously, a gold M4, so, you know, he melts me in three bullets. So yeah, I've been turning on a lot these past couple days, but anyways, let's, let's jump into it. Okay, we're gonna start off with the rear grip and we're gonna go with the stippled grip tape. So this is gonna increase your sprint to fire speed and your aim down sight speed, which you're gonna need on every single SMG. It's just gonna allow you to, you know, run and gun like we need to do with an SMG. So, I mean, there's some good, there's a lot of good stocks for the Bison, but personally the best one is the Corvus Skeleton stock. So that's gonna increase our aim walking movement speed, our movement speed, and our aim down sight speed. So this bad boy right here, it's, it's awesome. So you're gonna be able to strafe, a lot quicker, you're gonna be able to run around the map quicker, and your aim down sight speed is gonna be even quicker with the stipple grip tape, so this is a must have for the Bison. The only con is your aiming stability, which is your horizontal recoil, and I mean, you're using, a, you're using an SMG, so not bad at all. Next we're going with the laser, and like I say, for the SMGs, you wanna always run the five milliwatt laser. It increases your sprint to fire speed and your hip fire accuracy. It's the best attachment for SMGs because it just, you know, buffs all the things that allow you to run and gun. The TAC laser, it's good, but I would say that's more of a an assault rifle attachment. So we're gonna go with the five milliwatt laser. Next we got the barrel. Now the barrel, okay, there's some good options here, but we're gonna go with the polygonal. Now the steel, it gives you more buffs, but it also gives you an extra con, which is your movement speed. So these are the exact same thing, except for you get better recoil control, worse movement speed. But like I said, the bison, you don't want to be going for long range engagements anyways. So it doesn't really make sense to put on things that decrease your recoil because you're not gonna be able to kill people that far away, even if you can hit them. And plus it takes away from your movement speed and we're an SMG, so we need to be able to run around. So that's why I go with the polygonal. Increases your damage, increases your range. That's probably some of the best pros you can get. And so that's why we go with the polygonal. Now for our muzzle, we're gonna go all the way down here to the monolithic suppressor. So the monolithic suppressor takes away your sound, which is just a bonus because, I mean, I mean, just those little extra seconds it takes someone to spot you or hear you, that's an extra bonus, but we really want it for the damage range. This is going to increase our range even more, so maybe it'll make us kill people a little further away. We still don't want to be going super far away, but you know, that medium range, we got two damage range buffs, so you could probably kill them a little quicker. It takes away your aim down sight speed and your aim walking steadiness, but we got so many buffs on that, you know, you're not even gonna really notice. And the only bad thing about the monolithic suppressor is it makes our gun ugly. Look at that thing, man. That's nasty. Ruins the whole aesthetic of our bison. But hey, you gotta do what you gotta do to make it good. So this is our PP19 bison class. To summarize, we got the monolithic suppressor, the 8.7 polygonal barrel, the 5 milliwatt laser, the Corvus skeleton stock, and the stipple grip tape. This is what you're going to want to run for the PP-19 Bison in Modern Warfare. You run this on your Bison, guaranteed you're going to put in work with this bad boy. So, thank you guys for watching. If you did enjoy the video, a like is always appreciated. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one.